Jordan Travis was number nine on your quarterback list. He's obviously dealing yeah. with, we all know, a terrible injury. What are you hearing about JT? What do you think? Do you think he could get drafted? What are your thoughts there? Well, I've had an opportunity to talk to Jordan twice now leading up to the process. I talked to him. He was there at the ACC title game. I talked to him on the mm -hmm. sideline for a good little bit. He was in really good spirits at the time. And then also my second time was at the East-West Shrine Bowl in Frisco, Texas. Obviously, he couldn't participate, but he was there meeting with teams. And he said mm -hmm. he met with over 25 teams wow. when he was there. So there's an obvious interest in him. And just talking ball with him for 10 to 15 minutes, both of those times, you could tell the IQ was outstanding, the leadership skills. I mean, Mike Novell could talk about him for hours and hours at a time. We know the, the leadership skills and the intangibles are off the charts. It's a little bit undersized. Everybody knows that, but a prolific career. I look at teams like the New York Jets, um, the Arizona Cardinals, the New Orleans Saints that could take mm. a late-round developmental type mm. of quarterback. I, I think there's still a chance that he does get drafted in the later rounds. But at worst, if he's a priority free agent, he will not be on the market for long. There's going to be a lot of teams that are that are in the market for him. But all signs point to him eventually being ready um, sometime in training camp based on what uh, the information that I have gathered with him and what he talked to me. But everything's right on schedule with him and, you know, the infectious energy and just the leadership skills. I only talked to him for 30 minutes total at both of those stops. And you could tell just the energy that he gave off was terrific.